Hey my officials, welcome back to another video and if you're new, welcome. My name is Michelle. Welcome to the official family. And in today's video, I am going to be sharing with you guys how I blow dry and flat iron my hair and how I just basically style it. I will do a preview of the products that I am that I use on my hair um, so you guys will get to see what I use the tools and all of that good stuff so if you want to see how I blow dry and flat iron my hair please continue to watch and I'll see you guys at the end of this video and these are just some tools that I use when I'm blow drying my hair I really don't use a lot of things you really don't need to be drenching your hair with a lot of things and as you guys can see I basically just divide my hair into small sections and just make sure I blow dry those areas make sure that I get it very dried um, one thing I will say although my hair looks wet I don't um, blow dry my hair on damp on wet wet hair I kind of make sure it's towel dried and I also kind of air it out for maybe around 15 to 20 minutes before I blow dry it um, well what I'll do I'll do my makeup first and then I'll blow dry my hair because I feel like it gives it time to kind of like dry up so that's basically my blow drying process guys so I had to move to my bedroom because it started to rain and my bathroom is just too hot like and I don't want my roots to get wet because I sweat in my scalp so I don't have the luxuries as other people but this is basically how my relaxed hair is looking my hair feels very very healthy I am so happy that I decided to cut it because yeah yeah anyways um, what I normally do is I would part my hair in four. I use the Remington flat iron. I really do want to get a new one, but this is basically what I have. So this is what I use. And I put it on 350, which is, yeah, so I put it on 350. I personally don't think you need to flat iron your hair on anything higher than 350 or maybe 320. So I just put a little bit on my palm, just a little bit, not a lot, because a little goes a long way. You don't want to over saturate your hair with oil. And I'll rub it in the palm of my hands and I will just run it through this little section here and make sure you're getting your ends it's very very light again you don't want to use too much because So basically this is how my hair is looking as you guys can see it's mm, a bit not sleek as I would like it to be so what I normally do to get my hair sleek down because my hair is like three weeks three weeks post relaxer at this point I would just wrap it <laughs> After I wrap my hair, I would 
put on the rest of my makeup so you know it lets the hair set all right guys so my this is basically how my hair looks and how i end up styling my hair is i just simply take these short pieces in the front and i just tuck it behind my ears like so right to give it that look and I would leave like hair out here and I would also leave some hair out here just to give it a cute little look I think that this fits me very nicely and then what I would do I would just go in the, with the comb and I would just comb it down I would definitely be showing you guys how the back looks and then and then what I do for the front, I don't do a lot with my edges. You guys already know that here on my channel. If you are new, I really don't do a lot with my edges. So I will just put a little bit of this is what I use. The Mori's Edge Wax. And I just put a little bit of it like on my edges. Nothing to really talk about. Um, I'll just flick the hair back a little bit and just kind of press it against my edges um, and especially the front because I like to put like a fake widow's peak I think it looks cute and that way I'm just going to do this like so and then all of the product I just kind of comb it in I would just comb the product into my edges again I really don't do a lot with my edges and then I would just do the same thing because um, it's already like that so I would just press this against like so very very simple but it's I think it's a cute little style um, and I have a bunch of flyaways that I personally like to see but um, I also sometimes don't like to see it. It just depends on my mood. And I will just put a little bit of the edge wax on my flyaways just so that it's not too, too much flyaways. And not only that, the edge wax kind of helps. And this is just basically how I get my hair like this. I know you guys were asking. And yeah, this is basically how I get my hair like this. I'm going to turn to the back so that you guys can see how the back looks. This is basically where I'm going to end this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this short little how I blow dry my hair and how I style it. And I'll see you guys in my next upload. If you guys are interested to see what products I have been using on my hair to wash it, to treat it, please let me know in the comments. I will do a dedicated video for you guys on that. If you don't want to see it, then that's okay as well. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next upload. Again, thank you, thank you so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!